Hey guys, so it is my last morning here in Queensland before I go home. I am due on a flight in, oh, I don't know, a few hours. And uh, I've been trying to pack my bags up and get myself all ready to go home. It's a nice sunny day here today. And I'm going back to like extremely wet, um, windy, like possible thunderstorms in Adelaide. So. I've tried to get myself into like jeans, full length jeans, top, uh, a hoodie. I think I might even pack a coat to go over the top of me when I get to Adelaide. Um, this is feeling okay right now in this room, but in the sun I know I'll feel kind of hot, but that's all right. I'm only going to be on a plane. Um, I did watch some of the movie um, Glass coming over here, so I'm going to watch the rest of that. I've got an audio book. Um, Mum is staying a few extra days, so she's coming home on Monday. So this flight will be alone, but that's fine. I did want to quickly show you. I picked up some things while I was away, um, and we went to a charity shop. I got this pair of shorts that they have this flower um, detailing on them, which is so cute. Um, there is like a little bit of a mark somewhere on the back. Oh, over there. You, know, you might not be able to see it all that well, but I'll give them a wash. Um, there's a bit of an elastic waistband, so they're pretty good and they cost me $3.50. Um, and then here's my... got this skirt from the charity shop as well. Hmm, let me see if you can see it better if I can like that. So it's just this beautiful green floral print, flowy skirt um, with a like a tie up waist so you can sort of wear it on your hips so you can wear it on your waist and I wore that one yesterday um, that one cost me five dollars like we found this op shop that was having a closing down 50% off sale so all these were really good bargains um, now so this is the third thing from the charity shop it's a forever new jacket and there's little button details, which you can't see. There you go. Um, and it has a bit of a flare out at the waist. Um, it's super pretty, it's size 10. They have hairs on it apparently. Um, and this one cost me $4. This would have been a jacket that would have been somewhere around the 150 mark, I'd say. Maybe 120 to 150 when it was new and there's not a mark on it. It's awesome. <laughs> I always look out for forever new things in the op shops because um, surprisingly quite a bit of it does make it out there and I never pay full price um, when I shop at forever new. So sometimes I'll find some things on sale, other times it's just finding them in op shops. Oh, you are just closed. So I did get a few other things when we were shopping. This was one of them. It's just this nice green top with some lace detailing. I wore that yesterday with the skirt. I wore it, I, I bought it and I thought, I don't know if this is going to go with anything I've got in my wardrobe, but I have this feeling it, it's either going to go with something I'm not remembering or it's going to go with something I'm about to buy. <laughs> and then the next day I came across this skirt and amazing match. So this one was $7 from a store called SES and I thought for $7 that's fine. So I got that. Then I did actually go to Forever New and looked in their sales stock and found a jumpsuit that I liked. And now when I went to pay for this jumpsuit, which is this beautiful white jumpsuit. Yeah, probably not going to be able to see it, but it's got these really wide legs and it's all the way to the floor. Um, fits very nicely. It was originally $149.99. I got it for $39.95, but when I went to pay for it, they told me I had a birthday voucher that was $25 off, so I only paid $14.95 for this amazing white jumpsuit and honestly forever new stuff you can feel the quality difference 
just is amazing this fabric is great and that will be awesome I also got another jumpsuit because I'm really into them at the moment this one was from Ali um, and this one was also $15 but you can once again as I said like you can tell the difference in the quality but I love the color um, it might not show up very well on camera it's it's sort of like a deep salmony color has the wide legs again uh, very flowy it has this back that's slightly open um, with with ties that go around the top part so that's very very pretty I love this one I'm looking forward to wearing it all the way to the, the floor again these will probably be things I won't be able to wear till we come around to like late spring summer time so I'll just have to wait to be able to wear them so then I have this very cardigan which was from Miller's and it is so nice and soft and warm and I couldn't resist even just oh hello focus can you focus on me please um <laughs> Even just to wear around the house, just when it's those cold days and you just feel like snuggling up. Yeah, I love this. So it was $20, it was usually $50. Because um, we had a day at Harbour Town where there's outlet shops and you get all the like clearance items or whatever. So this one was from Miller's. Um, yes, I do have some shoes. I bought some shoes. We did some shopping at Big W and I came across these lightweight what like sneakers sports shoes whatever and they have this beautiful blue and purple shimmer to them <sighs> i was just, like they, they feel like socks with a bit of a sole it's amazing and they were 15 dollars so i'm really happy to wear <laughs> those at some stage they're awesome um, also at Big W, I got myself a pair of slippers, which I have worn heaps on holiday because I didn't bring any with me, and just of a night time to slip them on. Um, they were $12, and they got little, little love hearts on them, and nice rainbow pastel. Beautiful colouring. Uh, and then we went to a shoe store where I got some boots. So, these little little mid-calf boots they're not so much ankle they're a little bit higher than ankle um, but so these boots here they got a little buckle on them and they're kind of got Victorian style laces um, I got them for $30 and I think they were recommended retail of 70 so I just thought to have a kind of sleek option compared to the ones I usually wear. Um, I wear boots all the time in winter, so these will be great. Um, and 30 bucks, bargain, so. I think that's about all. I did buy a poster, um, which was a Toad Treasure Tracker, um, like gaming poster. I'm gonna put it on my wall in my office. And I think that's about it. So we've had like heaps of. Oh, oh wait. There was this headband. This one. So I wore this yesterday as well. I got it from the beachfront markets and it lights up. <laughs> so I thought this was really beautiful how the lights really illuminate like the entirety of the flowers. So um, that will be my, I think, fourth light up headband that I have. And they're great for night time just to have that little bit extra happening so we've done a lot of shopping um it's been really great to relax and we've done a lot of activities where you know we got the photos with the macaws and we got the photos like dressed up old timey um we went on the cruise we uh we had the dinner at hellenica which was really really tasty like, I honestly, at this point, don't know what I've talked about and what I haven't talked about. The last couple of days um, haven't, well, yesterday we didn't really get up to anything much. We just had a bit of a chill day. We went to a local shopping centre where I didn't buy anything because we we're pretty shopped out. <laughs> and then um, 
we chilled out for a while and then went for a walk by the river and today is just you know getting ready to catch a flight and the night before was just like relief in getting here and um catching up with mum's family friend um and her partner and just you know having a nice meal and all that but not all that much to film about um which is fine because it's been full on <laughs> We were meant to have a, a chill holiday and it's ended up being a lot of activities, which has been good to make memories, but I think I need a holiday when I get home, <laughs> meaning I'm probably not going to leave my house for a few days. Um, I'm really missing my cats. I'm excited to see them, have a look at the kittens and make, <clears throat> make sure they're going all right. <clears throat> also, this cold has been so much fun and I'm feeling... Um, a lot better than I have been, but I'm still a little bit sick, but blood at the end of the tunnel, you know, in time for me to go home from my holiday. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to get myself a drink of water. Hello, focus. Hello. <laughs> Just finished packing up my suitcases and uh, I'll be headed off to go home very soon. <laughs> 